allow me to flag the team and the cops from here up to the depot. This is John Makombo, the director for conservation of the Uganda Wildlife Authority, flagging off the first batch of cobs to be translocated to Kidepo Valley National Park. In here is where the captured cobs are, and they will be transported over 400 kilometers to the new destination. A total of 200 cobs are to be translocated in this second search activity following the translocation of 110 cobs to Kidepo in 2017. The translocation is aimed at reinforcing the cob population in Kidepo Valley National Park to enhance breeding, ecosystem balance and improve tourism among other objectives. This is one of the areas where we first discovered oil. Supposing if there is an oil spill here during production, can we say we have a safe population in Kidepo where again we can pick it and bring it back if these ones are affected? Every time that the lions hunt buffaloes, they are steady hunted because they are overpowered by the mighty horns of the what? Of the buffaloes. And so we have got a population of lands that is actually going down in Kidepo. But we need to save it. And by saving it, we need to take a species of animal that can multiply very fast and a species of animal that the lions can actually feed on. The Kaboya Wildlife Reserve, which covers 87 square kilometers, currently holds an estimated population of 8,000 cobs, among other wildlife, which has increased pressure on the land. And so we think it is the time for us now to ease the pressure of grazing from Kaboya so that we can take the extra cobs into Kidepo where we need them. We are catching Uganda cobs and taking them to Kidepo to recover the place so that is really in Kidepo. As the animals are being moved, the truck is not supposed to stop unnecessarily. Unless maybe the, the, the drivers want to answer calls of nature. Otherwise for them they keep moving. If we need to top up fuel, a cruiser will come and top up. If they need food, the cruiser will run very fast and give them the sausages they want and uh, the water and so on as we continue going. The 30 cobs captured in the first batch on the first day had to endure a 485 kilometer journey before they were successfully released in Kidepo Valley National Park. Baby! Oh, the babies! This is Kidepo Valley National Park, the new home of the cobs that were translocated from Kapoya Wildlife Reserve in Hoima. Ghana Wildlife Authority believes that the number of uh, lions which was declining in this particular park due to lack of prey is now bound to go up. Benjamin Jumbe, NTV.